Okay, 60% of people in the village vaccinated against flu. Population in the village is vaccinated and catches flu is 0.12. That's given here. Probably the person is in the village who is not vaccinated, vaccinated catches flu is 0.9. We've got to complete the tree diagram and fill in the boxes showing the probability of each possible outcome. Okay, for three marks. Well, if that's 0.6, that'd be 0.4. Chance of being vaccinated 0.6, therefore 0.4 is not. I can do this one 0.4, no, followed by yes. I always could mark that as a cross, that means to times 0.4 times 0.9. Well, four nines are 36. It's one number, there's two numbers after the decimal, so it must be two numbers are here. So 0.36. That's 0.1 times m. So 0.1 times well, 1 times 4 is 4. But this has got to be one, two numbers off the decimal point, so that would be 0 0.04. Now I've got to try and fill this bit in. We know that this 0 0.6 times by something is 0 0.12, so that will be 0 0.2. Just check that. 6 twos are 12. Needs two numbers off the decimal point. If that's 0 0.2, that will be 0 0.8. And 0 0.6 times 0 0.8, 6 8 is 48. Two numbers off the decimal place, 0 0.48. We have to work out the probability a person in the village chosen at random does not catch flu. Well, how can it, this catches flu, how can it be not catch flu? Let's do it in red so I can see it. That would be a not catch flu. And that one would also be a not catch flu. And so we've got 0.48. We have to add it to 0 0.04. And that is 0 0.52 as my answer. That's question 23 and the end of the paper. It's done.